Are we ready? Now we're gonna lift up the curtains on stress, understand the effects, and learn strategies to manage it. A little is normal, but a lot is not. So what can you do about this? What people get wrong about self-care is that they think that self-care is selfish. It's about happiness in your life, your friends, and understanding why stressful situations can create such an impact. And right now is how you need to stop that. Now let's talk about some ways to reduce it, like 21 ways. Your cortisol level doesn't know when to shut off, which can lead to problems like high blood sugar levels and fatigue. And a lot of people end up getting that midriff roll that comes on their lower abdomen. Really gonna be focusing on that autonomic nervous system. We have what's called your parasympathetic and your sympathetic nervous system, which is your rest and digest and active and alert or fight or flight. But I want you to understand the structure of this nervous system. So these activities can stimulate your vagal nerve and increase the activity, helping to promote a sense of well-being and relaxation. It actually is the most powerful form of decreasing that vagal nerve and supporting the nervous system for the day. You will feel the shift. People always say, do you ever have a bad day? And I say, yes, and they're like, but you're always smiling. Because why not? Why not? Negative thoughts are often much easier than positive thoughts. And we get into this cycle. It's time to declutter your mind. You need to start thinking more positively for yourself. Dream up something that you would never think possible. The day she let go of the things that were weighing her down was the day she began to shine her brightest.